Hi guys, it's Paul Lynch here, and for those of you who've been following me for a while, you'll know that I never do a personal review on any products unless I'm actually using it myself. Um, and I think it's amazing, it's got to be amazing. Now this one from Josh um, is absolutely amazing. I've only been using it for, for like 30 minutes, it's so easy to use, and it just makes your images it makes them stand out from the crowd. So if you're into any Facebook advertising, Instagram ads, YouTube, anything like that, you really need this software in, in your arsenal. Um, just let me show you what it does. So this is one that literally took me, I don't know, five minutes to create, okay? So this is this was, this was is my holiday lodge here on, on this um, new uh, holiday park that's just been built. And so I've added the headers, the the two thousand pound giveaway, and I've helped, I've added the three nights stay for six. Okay, you can actually add text as well inside Photo Vibrance. But I just want to show you what I what I uploaded. So I uploaded this photograph with the lodge and the lake, and obviously got the lovely views. And just watch what what happens now after I'd exported it using uh, Photo Vibrance. So you've got the fire burning with the smoke coming, you've got the money falling down. And look at the lake, the lake is actually moving as well. Okay guys, so I'm going to show you really quickly how I did this. So I've just opened up um, Photo Vibrance here. I'm quickly just going to upload the exact same image. Okay, so let me just grab this here, which is that one there. Now with this, guys, you've actually got this extra option, 3D. This, this three, look at this 3D. The advanced option here have just come off it. You can see, I've not actually got into that yet. That looks even better. But let me just show you what this software does. Just like if you're a newbie and you just wanted to enhance your uh, your images for your social channels okay so if you can click any click any of the different sizes i'm just going to click custom so it's the one that um so it gets my whole the original there as you can see okay just going to click next so i'm using the original f image that i've uploaded photograph so here we go. Are you ready, guys? Watch how quick this is. So for this example, I'm not going to spend too long on it. You can add loads of different effects like the, the fire burning and the smoke and the mist. And you can even add butterflies coming out. You can add lots and lots of things, you different skylines. I'm just going to show you how I made the lake move. Okay, so quickly go to Anchors, Single. And all you do, you just draw around the lake here. So I'm just drawing these dots around the lake. So it's anything within side the dots or the anchors as these these are called will move. Everything outside will will stay static. So it's really easy to understand as well. This is what I love about this software. It literally, guys, I hardly had to watch any tutorial videos. It's just like right, anything that is inside the dots. I know that's that terminology is proper basic, but that's just shows you how amazing this software is for any newbies out there. So anything inside the dots you can make move, everything else will stay the same. So pretty straightforward. So I'm just gonna go to the end there. Okay, so just done that. So I've I've covered the lake. Okay, then I go to arrows and go single. And then all you do, guys, is pick which way you want the lake or whatever it is you want to move, move. So I just want it to move this way because you can see the ripples are going towards my log cabin anyway. And the beauty about this is you can actually play what the image is going to look like before you export. So if you feel like you've missed um, a little bit, it's really, really easy and simple. Uh, to locate where you've missed. So for example, I'll show you, I'll miss something on purpose here. Okay, so I'm just gonna miss, I'm gonna miss off this little bit here, guys, and just watch, you'll see it stands out, it doesn't move. So when you press play to preview, watch. 
Look at that, guys. Can you see the lake moving? You can see this little bit here. Is, in fact, it looks all right, just being still there. But if you wanted it to um, to move, you just press stop. And then you just fill in the gaps, if you get what I mean. So there we go. Press play again. You can see it's now moving, like a bit of a waterfall going down there. You can actually speed things up. So it actually looks better when you speed up a little bit. Okay, guys, and that's how easy it is. And all you do, you just press um, publish here, and it saves an MP4 or a GIF. Look at that. Super easy. It looks absolutely insane. Just to quickly show you the effect, so you can actually add, like I said in my video that you just just saw, I add like a burning fire and some money falling down. So you just go to effects, then click on effects here. You see you've got like the dollar signs. Um, you can actually change the skyline. There's lots and lots and lots you can do, guys, and it's super easy. So, for example, you can add butterflies. So if I just click on the butterfly and it just drag and drop it on here, I could have the butterfly up here in the trees. Um, you've got there's all sorts. There's fires. There's donuts. There's energy. There's explosions. There's lightning. What the there's the fire. So I just drag and drop the fire. So you just drag and drop it where you want it to go and it plays super easy highly recommended guys even if you don't think you're going to use this today tomorrow this week grab this now for the discounted price uh, before the price rises and just leave it on your desktop because you will use this forever highly highly recommended